Hi, I'm Zoe Lem, stylist and owner of My Sugarland, and today I'm going to give you some insider's tips on how to do fashion. I'm now going to show you how to wear a kimono dress. So, you could do this for evening or for daytime. Because of the shine of the fabric, it'd be a really great dress for evening, really easy. Just chuck it on over a pair of tights or leggings. But you could also do it for daytime. It's a great dress for wearing both ways. So, for evening, rather than go very oriental feel, it's swapping it up a little bit and going against. So we're going to go glammy, but it's just a kimono style dress. Just going with the fact that it's really flattering, it's A-line and it's nipped in, rather than the fact that it's an oriental kimono style dress. So, heels, again metallic, so sticking with the shine of the dress, going for a platform heel by Harvard, a good size heel, so it's going to give you a great stance, it's going to give you a great shape through the leg. And then just keeping it simple and just going for sparkly earrings, you don't need a necklace, this neckline is your necklace. So just go for ears and then a little clutch bag um, or something that goes over the shoulder and just keep it very simple. You don't want to go oriental in the style of hair. The whole thing is like with doing vintage or doing period clothing. You don't want to go in theme. So with this, you don't want to look like a geisha girl. You want to mix it up. So just go sparkly, keep it glam and keep it very simple. And all of the detail is in the dress. If you want to do it more daytime, Again, with this particular dress being such earthy tones, we're going to go with that and we're going to go more kind of English eccentric -y. So we're just using this as a base shape. So a gilet is a really great way of adding the warmth, but you don't want to ruin the shape. You've got these sleeves, that's quite difficult to wear under a coat, but you can still add warmth. If it's really cold, you can do jersey sleeves underneath. Just go for something very simple within the tones of the dress and it won't ruin the shape. A gilet is a really great way of it's not going to affect the arms. You've got this beautiful shape through the arm and it's a real shame to ruin that by, by um, fitting them into a coat. So by doing this, you're still going to keep warm. You can be out and about doing whatever. It's a great little uh, shopping outfit even because you can layer it up and when you're in the shops, you can take off a layer at a time as you're trying on. So you've got the mix of textures, but it's still got a sheen through it. So it's still bright and still going to lift the face. Then. We're going to do the scarf. We're picking up in the colours that we've got. And it's actually kind of a slightly oriental fabric, but we're not going to tie it in an oriental way. We're going to mix it up and just slot that in there. So you've got the warmth, you've got that colour. If you've got brown eyes, that's going to be great for lifting out the colour of your eyes. And then we're going to do boots with this for a daytime. So leather boots, laced ones here. These ones by Hoss, really great for adding the shape and narrow through the leg. But it's not going to be. It's not going to be too much. We're mixing up the layer, leather. We've got the silk. We've got the fur, and then we're going to finish it off with a little leather hat. You don't have to wear everything, but that's going to be a really great little shape and really great little colours. That's how to wear a kimono dress.